Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Prototech. Um, it's been a little while, I'm sorry about that. I just haven't been making videos recently other than just editing some highlights, which I'm sure you guys have seen. But yeah, we're here on the server again and today we're going to be working on the world eater and maybe something else, I don't know, depends how long I take on this video because... I, I kind of want this released in a few days, and I don't know how long this is going to take, so we're working on the World Eater here. Um, I think I've said this in the last one, but we want to make a perimeter around spawn that's in, a, in an octagonal shape, and I think it's like 1k... Um, 1k from one end to another, not the radius, the uh, diameter, that's the one. So yeah, I'll be. I'm gonna be working on this a bit today, and just thought I'd share a little bit. Um, here's some shulker boxes that are empty. I think this was just used to make the trenches. Um, so those ones seem to be cleared, but that one down there hasn't been cleared yet. Uh, I have collected a bit of slime already. Um, this it, this should be enough here. Uh, I need to collect everything else, but I'm gonna start with the melons. I think because that's the simple thing to get laid down for now. And, yeah, we can see how big this is. It's not too big. Uh, it's about the same size as the last one, I think. And that didn't take too, too long to build, I think. So, should be alright. We can probably do this in a few days. So, yeah, that it's like that. And then it goes, like, 100 or so blocks this way. 200 blocks, whatever. And this is spawn. Over here, we don't need to do a trench because it's already cleared out, which is nice. So, yeah, let me just go get the rest of the materials that I need, and we'll get on with this, I suppose. I probably won't be showing all of the building, because it is just pretty boring. Here's some resources from the last world eater. Um, some pistons, sticky pistons. So, you, uh, yeah, I'll be taking some of these for later. I don't know what these are, but looks like decent resources as well. And, yeah, uh, let's get on with this. Right, so I've made my way to the villager island, as it's called, and trying to find the right farm. So I, I did say, actually, that we're going to be building a new sugarcane farm. That has been put on hold for a moment, I think, because we haven't decided on design. We keep thinking of better ideas or discovering that what we're doing is actually kind of crap. So, yeah, we're going to be doing something else, but this... This is not a big enough sugarcane farm. We're actually running out of sugarcane pretty fast. I don't even think we have melon, so I'm going to need to look around wherever, find where melon is. I don't even know what this is. What is this? Um, oh, this is melon and pumpkin. Okay. Um, so where does this go? I think it goes somewhere over here. Yeah. That's pumpkin. Is there melon here as well? Just pumpkin. Um, is this literally just pumpkin? Do we not have melon? Oh no. <laughs> okay, that's a slight problem because I I actually don't think we have any left. Uh, what is all of this? This looks useful. Seeds? Oh my god, we need to sort our things out and beets. Okay, so it's wheat and beets. Doesn't seem particularly useful to us, so... Yeah, let me look around and see if I can find a melon stash somewhere. Okay, so I think I found it here. Uh, I'll take... I'll take a few shulker boxes back to main storage as well, actually, because it would, it would be nicer to know where it actually is. It is just down here where the villager trading is. Um, and I'm gonna die. <laughs> okay, let's just take the let's just take the ladder. Yeah. Yeah, just storing these melons here. I think we only need about three shulker boxes, so that's all I'm gonna take. I don't think we even need that much, but. Uh, let's actually check, um, material list, of course it won't let me view that, because Light Massacre's stupid in many ways, and I, I wish it could be improved in those ways. So yeah, um, I'm gonna take a few shulker boxes over, I think I'll, I'll, I'll probably get the rest of the stuff later, to be honest. Yeah, let's go back to spawn, and let's start building. And this is going to be my life for a little while now. Yeah, so overall we actually use just a little bit less than a full shulker box. That's actually quite surprising. I thought we'd sure use more than that, but 
e even with wasting a bit like pillaring up and stuff in places we use less than one so that's pretty nice and there's still a lot to go so yeah i'm not gonna be relaxing anytime soon luckily for me though this, it's not too ha bad to build like i remember building this and like once you get in the rhythm of it it's like really easy especially these uh just these modules um i'm not sure about the sweepers and the other side the return i haven't i wasn't working on those i was working on the tnt modules last time so we'll have to see how that goes but I, i'm hopefully i'm not going to be the only one building all of this but at the moment i am so i i need to figure it out how to get into the flow of things quickly and it'll it'll be fine yeah totally all right so i just got a little bit of white glazed terracotta here because that's what the hello uh, okay there it is because that's what the um schematic wants so i figured i might as well do that uh, this little thing is just built over here next to the quad witch hut which is currently a double witch hut because a world eater kind of ran over here a while ago uh let me break this minecart and let me get the minecart back all right i'm gonna leave this somewhere here not running though um I'm gonna put this over here for someone else and yeah so I, I was just looking around here and for a while I've been looking around here and I was thinking that I should probably at least try to get the perimeter rebuilt so get this wall on the outside rebuilt so I might do that sometime soon um it is on my to-do list there's a block missing over here it's really annoying um so yeah, Ooh, what's what's this furnace? Sorry, what's what's over here? Sand. We need sand, actually. Yeah, nice. I'll take a few of these shulker boxes. Uh, just sand. Is that it? Okay. Yeah, we need some of the shulker boxes of sand, actually. We're we're low on sand as well, so yeah. At some point, I might build this. Um, it'll probably be done on stream. I probably won't do much of a video on this, but yeah. I, I want to get this area rebuilt. Oh my god, this is so laggy. Alright, time to stop recording. Alright everybody, so I've actually just come back from a little trip. I've been away for a few days, and it looks like the piston... Uh, piston bolt? No, I was just thinking of a piston bolt. Um, the world eater here is pretty much complete. Just need to drain the rest of this, and... It looks like it's going to be good to go. I've actually had a few uh, issues with my computer recently, so uh, I don't have Lightmatic uh, right now. I do have Lightmatic, but I don't have Lightmatics. But yeah, so I can't verify like, the schematic, um, but it looks like it's all complete. So I'm just going to work here for a little bit, try to clear this water. And yeah, we'll see how this goes. Um, it doesn't look like there's too much to do, but yeah, this looks like it's almost ready to go. So that's good. Someone, someone actually did it. That's very nice. All oh, right, it has been some time once again. Something like a week, I don't know. Time passes quick. And a little bit more progress has been done here, I suppose. Um, it looks like it's just this water that needs clearing, mostly. Which is being done slowly, I guess. Um, I, don't, I don't really have time to work on this myself at the moment, so I'm just relying on other people to work on this. But, yeah, it looks like... Pretty much all of the trenches are ready to go apart from this over here. And then once this is done, we can run the World Eater. I do have other projects that I want to work on as well. So I think in within the duration of this video, we'll probably... We probably won't see this running, but hopefully we'll see a little bit of progress on other things. And yeah, I did, I did a little bit of digging over here and that was about it. And then everything else was done by other people. Yeah, that's a little update for now. Alright, so the World East is going to be getting run sometime within the next few days. I'm not entirely sure when, but whenever that happens. And in the meanwhile, I want to work on fixing this Squad Witch Hut perimeter. Um, so, as you, some of you may know, a World Eater ran over this and destroyed part of the storage here and half of the perimeter. So, yeah, I want to I wanna fix up the perimeter here. Um, probably won't get around to doing the floor here because that's a lot of black stained glass. We do have the ink sacs for it, but we don't have the glass, so I'm, I'm not going to bother with that at the moment. At the moment, I just want to get the walls right. Um, when somebody was rebuilding this, they built it wrong, so you can see this doesn't connect quite right, and so they built 
part of this wrong as well, so I'm going to need to tear it out a little bit and rebuild it as the schematic says. Fortunately, I copied the schematic from this section over here, so in the schematic it's wrong over there as well, but I'm sure I can work around that. And yeah, that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing here. Um, the schematic was just a few squares, so I don't take too big of an area. And uh, yeah, I got all the resources... <laughs> I got so scared there for a second. I put them all over here. Um, yes, yeah, so I got all the resources for it. Got this took a little while to collect, but we we got it. Um, the storage is a mess. I didn't know where half the things were. Half of the other things I needed to go look in other places, like this prismarine stuff. I needed to go craft it myself at the Guardian Farm, and I think it ran out of prismarine actually. So, yeah, that's that. And. Yeah, I guess that's a little progress update from this moment on. I want to get this video released soon, so I probably won't finish all of this. And we probably won't do a whole lot else. Maybe if the world leader's running, I'll show a few clips of that. But for now, this is all I'm going to be doing. And yeah, I suppose the video will probably be coming to an end somewhat soon. Alright, so I've got half of this done now. I haven't built this tower here yet. Uh, I will sometime later, but I've got half of this done now. I'm still working on this. Uh, I've got resources here ready to continue. Uh, but I think for today, that's going to be pretty much it. Um, in the next one, I think I want to work on either the Shogun farm or Cactus farm. <laughs> this is this has been running for a long time now, actually. I wonder how much we've got. Um, Almost, almost three chestfuls. Um, all right, so that's that's pretty neat. So yeah, I think I want to work on that next after I do this. We've uh, finished running the world eater now, so let's go check that out real quick, I suppose. Uh, let's just go through the end here real quick. And yeah, there's not really a whole lot to do here now that's the wrong way <laughs> um yeah so this is all done now that's pretty cool i guess all of this lava needs to be uh gotten rid of but we'll we'll do that some other time for now what we need to do is we need to clear this diagonal section here but uh we're gonna need to build a diagonal world lead for this i i don't know how that works i am not really the slimestone guy um, so yeah, that'll be interesting, but we'll, we'll see how this goes. Um, I am definitely not digging this by hand because I dug a small section, much smaller, like from here to that corner, kind of small, uh, it's a different location that took forever. So I'm not doing this whole section, especially that it's water. That that's just pain. So yeah, uh, I guess what I'm saying is there's a lot to do still on this server and I've got a few plans for the future. Actually, I've got a few really cool plans for the future as well, but first we're going to get some better resources set up because, okay, I was a bit confused there. There's extra glass there. Never mind. Um, but yeah, we're going to need to get a few extra farms set up for resources because we're, we're, not, we're not exactly rich here in terms of like everything. Like we've got resources, but that some of them are a bit of a pain to get so yeah i'm gonna try to get some things set up for that but yeah for now thank you for watching hope you enjoyed uh this little progress update i suppose whatever you call this and i'll see you in the next one have a good day bye bye